Larson. I'm the Territory Manager for Cave Curve, Los Angeles North. Handpiece maintenance is vitally important for the longevity of your handpieces. You wouldn't buy a new car and neglect to change the oil or bring it in for routine maintenance. The same is true for handpieces. Handpieces have moving parts that spin very fast with RPMs ranging from tens of thousands to hundreds of thousands. It is crucial to keep these moving parts lubricated and clean free from debris, which would wear them out prematurely. Proper handpiece maintenance will protect your investment and extend the life of that handpiece. You invested in a tool that you use in dentistry every day, and caring for it properly will ensure your investment is working with you at a high level for a long time. It will also bring consistency to your repair expenditures, reducing unexpected overhead costs. Now I will demonstrate how to manually maintain your handpieces. First, wipe down your handpiece with a damp towel. If there is still some bio burden left on the handpiece, clean under running water using a brush. A mild detergent is acceptable. Be sure that all bio burden is removed before going on to the next step. In general, wipe disinfection is not recommended. If excessive amounts of disinfectant or non-improved disinfectant is sprayed into the handpiece or the motor turbine coupling, malfunctions may occur. Choose the appropriate nozzle for the back end of your handpiece and place the handpiece on the adapter of the lubricant's nozzle. Spray the lubricant for approximately two seconds. Count one, two. Lubricate the chuck weekly with the adapter provided with the lubricant. Wipe down the exterior of the handpiece with a dry towel to remove any expelled fluid or debris. The handpiece should be completely dry at this point. Connect the handpiece to the air supply to purge. Before you can apply air pressure, position the head of the handpiece with a paper towel to prevent a mess. Run the handpiece for approximately 30 seconds. If the purge lubricant on the paper towel is not clear, re-lubricate and purge until the fluid is clear. Continue to run the handpiece until all excess lubricant is expelled. Bag and sterilize for the manufacturer's instructions. Be sure to allow the handpiece to complete the drying cycle. Do not, under any circumstances, run a handpiece underwater to cool down. This will cause significant damage to the handpiece. Do not re-lubricate the handpiece after sterilization. Unscrew, remove the head of the attachment. Insert the shaft into the E-type nozzle that is already attached to your can of lubricant. Spray the lubricant for two to three seconds. Spray each separately. Assemble the attachment back together. 